miss me or what? Oh, yes, I've been seeing a lot of me lately. There's been so much flow and just, ooh, it's coming out of me and I'm loving it. I'm just riding that wave and really enjoying it. I'm here in paradise down by the pool and um, I've been in by the bar just creating content and really just, pff, it's coming through and I'm, I'm not stopping the channeling. So um, what I want to talk about was this morning, like pinch me, it felt so bizarre but I managed to literally manifest my perfect morning within 24 hours. And something we get caught up in, and I know I've spent so long getting caught up in the how, like, but how's it gonna work? I don't have the money in the bank, or I don't have the, the car, I don't have the means, I don't have the stuff, I don't have the thing. And, um, you know, I'm, I'm sitting there going, I don't know how to make this work, and I don't, I want this. I see the things that I want and I'd like to have, but the how, is the part that dulls it. It's the part that kind of squashes the dream and the energy and the vibe. And, and when we get stuck in the how, it's what I've been tormented with for so many years is I've spent, you know, nine years going backwards and forwards on what I know I want and what I vision, but then I get stuck in the how and it fizzles out and dies and falls apart or, um, or just falls short. So this morning, I literally, kid you not, realized at about 11 that I'd manifested my perfect day my dream day and here I am spending the rest of my day doing even more of my dream day and it's just it gives me chills it's so uncanny to realize that you can do so much and we have so many people around us at the moment teaching us or speaking of and blurting out and blah about manifesting and I've always been whatever doesn't work or it's just seemed like fluff and bs until this morning I kind of went ah. Oh, Oh my gosh, realizing that I've been stuck on the how and wanting it to actualize in the expectations and the, the thoughts that I believed it needed to be to get it, to achieve it. And the cool thing is, is that last night I'm flying up here to Cairns and uh, my accountant of all people had sent me an ebook, an, an audio book. So I'm sitting there listening on the plane and I'm jotting down and she's got me writing out my 90 day plan or my visual or my, my perfect day. And I was like, oh, you know what, got nothing to lose. Why not? Let's do this. So I'm writing out my 90 day plan and I kid you, word for word, my morning unfolded. Now, we woke up this morning with no expectations, no obligations. It was just like, whatever, let's just have a, a beautiful morning. So we wake up to no alarm. We get up and put our clothes. Oh, we have, you know, nice cuddles. Yeah, it's nice. We're in a hotel room. Why not? I'm not going to go too far into any of that stuff. Um, we wake up, nice cuddles throw our shoes on, go for a walk along the amazing esplanade here that we have down here in Cairns. It's astonishing. And then we go for a walk and I'd written in this, this diary, in this, this book, word for word, that, you know, my loving partner and we've got time, we're not, not pushed by any alarms and we get up and we go for a walk because he knows my body and he understands that I'm someone who, and this is if you follow my, my, my discussions and my, my preaching about um, the health types and, and how each health type is different. Some people wake up in the morning and they're like, action, go, let's get moving. For me and my type, it's like my brain just starts to go into this, this overload. And a lot of our overdone um, health types, like uh, overload versions of my health types. So if you're someone who's similar to me, but you allow your brain to take over and it really just goes off and it's, it, that's where we get these anxious people who are out of balance, who are not running well. And so they go into these um, anxious mornings and they believe their expectations of what they need to be doing are so far up here. But what my partner knows is that for me, he needs to get me into my body before we can connect and before he can get a really decent version of, of my beautiful self. So we get up and we go for a walk. And on our way back, we get breakfast by the water. A beautiful, healthy breakfast bowl, beautiful smoothie, a nice chai latte. And then we walk back. And then he knows. He knows that it's the connection time. It's the time when I am in my body. I am fully present. I am fully loved up. And I'm, I'm ready to receive and connect and so much more. I'm not going to go into details here. But the beautiful thing about it is, is that I wrote it word for word, not 24 hours beforehand. And it actually happened. Then my, my, my next part of the process is, I went off and said, then he leaves for his job, and which in my vision is actually where we both got our, our perfect world of he's got his own products and all the rest of it. So you know what I feel right now? I feel fucking driven more than ever. 
to create what I'm creating, driven more than ever to show up, driven more than ever to speak my truth, more than ever to be everything I'm meant to be for you so I can lead the way, so I can show the way, so I can create the life that I freaking wrote because I've got most of it down pat. It's just waiting for the rest to un unfold and to show itself. So I'm driven more than ever so that I don't have to see him drop in energy and have to leave before he wants to. I don't want to have to see my partner feel resentful or, um, or not happy in the rest of his day because I would idealistically like to have it where I'm doing my webinars and leading my team and creating from a space of abundance, love, joy, connection and he is too. I know he is my king and I know he has so much potential in this world but he's stuck in this the world that he created, the prison that he created for himself. And so many of us have. And you know, it's been a, it's not been an easy journey for me to come away from that and start to create um, the space of freedom and to surrender and just let it be, let life be and become all that I want to create. Because the how doesn't freaking matter. It's just showing up and being that version of yourself that you're meant to be, that is guided, that is in tune, that is not expecting the how and just allowing it to be. Isn't that really great? I know I'm going off on a tangent and a ramble, but to know that we got so close within 24 hours, I manifested within 24 hours my perfect morning, now I just gotta work on the rest of it. Does that make sense? It's like I've now had a taste of it and now I'm hungrier than ever. Now I'm so driven, I am so connected and I'm so passionate about sharing this with so many others. My journey is there for a reason, so I can share it, so I can show the way. So the cool thing is that we have a group on Facebook that's free, a Facebook, a community of like-minded people who we are showing these things to. We're giving the tools, we're giving an epic abundant amount of all the tools that people pay thousands upon thousands. I know people that are teaching manifestation courses that are charging thousands, thousands on how to be abundant, how to manifest, how to be the leader, how to rule the online world. People pay thousands of dollars to understand how to do Facebook ads and how to jump into the Facebook markets and how to learn how to sell to the cold markets. And here we are, we have it all for you in the one place and it's free and we hold your hand and walk you through it because we are so ridiculously invested in your success. Our success is relying on your success and that creates a community of like-minded, passionate, driven, epic, freaking humans set on changing the world. Do you feel me? Give me a, hand, a hands up, a high five. Please also give me a hashtag when you're watching the replay to this. It's, we've created these communities because we are driven to attract the people who are going to rise above and rise with us and make change. Make change in this world. Make a world where we get to manifest daily, whatever the hell we want. We get to get out of our own way, we get to deal with our bullet BS, and we get to we get to show, nourish, and, and provide for each other. And to me, that's the community, that's the world I want to live in. I want to live in that through and through every single day. I want to wake up in this kind of haven and know that I've created it and I have the opportunity to keep creating that for myself and others. So if you're someone who's driven by this, if this tickles you, if it, if it triggers you, whatever the heck. Just give me a, um, a high five or an emoji below and I'll, I'll definitely add you into the group. It's a free group. We're going to be adding so much of this free content, showing you how we manifest in a day or less our dreams, showing you how we're utilizing the online world, how we use the simple tools that we hold your hand to step you through so you understand it all too. I'm no one special. I'm just like you. And yet everyone seems to think that this is too hard. Everyone seems to think that it's, a, it's a, a, an anomaly and it's not. It's possible for every single person in every single situation. Um, and I still have a day job at the moment. I still have the normal world. But I knew that this, was, this normal world, the normal track was not going to serve me for much longer. So it's knowing that we get the chance, opportunity every single day to pave the way, to choose a different path, to create the hustle on the side that then enables us to have more choice, more freedom, more everything in the later you know, what are you, are you willing to do a movement now? Are you willing to step up and rise above and get a little bit uncomfortable in the moment? Like a band-aid, rip that shit off with a whole heap of effort. Know that that pain, that feeling, that anguish is only a moment in your time. And on the other side, you know, on that other step, that tiny little ledge, you take that step and that's where the magic happens. 
that's where the magic happens, my friends. And if you are ready for that journey, I urge you to pop an emoji below so that I can give you the chance to jump into this community. Check it out for yourself. And who cares? If you don't like it, if you decide that you're not ready, if you haven't got the balls to step up and make the life of your choice, that's cool. Just jump out of the group. No harm, no foul. But what have you got to lose? Where are you now that you're not comfortable? Where are you now that you are stuck? Where are you now that you want more? Your time is now. There's been no better time than now. It is perfect. It is exactly what you need. If you feel tickled, if you feel drawn, if you feel compelled to ask more questions, then do so. Don't hide. Don't hold back. This life is for living. It's no, this isn't a practice, guys. This is the life you have. This is the life that you have. Make it yours by your design. Adios amigos, it's time to go enjoy more of this beautiful weather here in Cairns. I am wearing a short, long sleeve, I know, but the weather is glorious. And I'm going to go explore the rest of the town.